The stars of Roadhouse fought their way through the rain in London for the UK special screening of the upcoming action flick. The Prime Video movie, which is out on the 21st of March, is a remake of the 1989 cult classic starring Patrick Swayze, with Jake Gyllenhaal taking over the lead role as Dalton. Conor McGregor makes his acting debut as hard-hitting hitman Knox, and while on the red carpet, Hollywood star Jake said he had to remind Conor he wasn't back in the octagon for his fight scenes. Uh, when, as soon as I heard that he was accepting the role, I was like, I was so excited, and then I was like, oh no, I have to fight this guy, or at least fake fight this guy. But then what I realized is that like he knows how to fight, obviously, but he doesn't know how to fake fight. And so he had to sort of unlearn tons of things. And I had to remind him pretty constantly, like just remember four takes, like just remember don't, you, you don't need to actually punch me in the face. He'd be like, oh, right, right, right. You know, like, like as if in his mind he was ready to really do it. So, um, First of all, I'm glad for my own memory to remind him, and I also am, he was, but he didn't, and it was really sweet. Meanwhile, Connor himself admitted he had to pull his punches when the stunts kicked off, but what was more nerve-wracking, being in his first film or the first time he ever stepped foot in the UFC octagon? Wow. You know, I had, you know, fake it till you make it, you know, the octagon is, the octagon is heavy and intense, but I had to pretend, you know, I had to act like I was... You know, Knox, my character is Knox, I'm the big bad guy, I'm the hit man, I'm the main guy. You know, I'm here to do a job and no one's going to stop me. So that was my mindset going in and, you know, although I might not have been feeling it really deep inside me, I cast it as if I was and, you know, I hope I came across as such. Meanwhile, Lucas Gage, who plays Billy in the High Octane film, finally got to work with his longtime hero, Jake Gyllenhaal. Jake. I looked up to Jake, I'm not even kidding, Donnie Darko was my favorite movie of all time. I memorized the whole movie from start to finish as a kid, so this character was really easy to play. I, I looked up to him in the movie, and yeah, no acting required, really. So what does it feel like to be on set that? It's crazy. I mean, it's uh, surreal. It's been a dream of mine, and then you get there, and he's just like a nice guy, and uh, you know, they say don't meet your heroes, but I've met my hero, and you should meet them, because he's a nice, he's a nice dude and he really gave me a lot of tips on acting. I mean, that was a crazy, surreal experience. And speaking of heroes, A-lister Jake couldn't let Roadhouse happen without some touching additions in honor of late actor Swayze. I have, I, we designed some tattoos that my character wears in honor of him. And, um, and also he was just sort of with me in my mind a lot throughout the process, you know? I mean, the characters originated by him. Um, I knew him. I, I, I also think about it like I think about things in the theater, you know, we all play roles that other people have played, you know, classics and stuff, and he made a classic role, and so I, I kind of approach it like that, with the intimidation of the fact that he had made a cold classic, and, but at the same time wanted to make it my own. I know he'd be okay with it. For more red carpet news and entertainment stories, check out virginradio.co.uk. Virgin Radio.